Man, what's good, everybody, man? This is Cooking with Micaiah, man. It's been a long time since I made a video. If you see some of my old videos, I was wilding with the cream of wheat while we pepperating. This is ugly, man. Like, why? Like, I always wanted to do this, though. So, I'm reintroducing myself. I'm Nick Perk, AKA Micaiah. I'm the same person. I just do a lot. But today, we're going to be making pancakes, protein keto pancakes. We gonna keep it street. I don't know how many carbs is in this thing. I just know it's pretty low, you know what I'm talking about? This recipe I'm making is a mixture of people, other YouTubers, Keto Connect. I just remixed it my way. So let's go and we gonna get it popping. First thing is first, almond flour. You see this almond flour right here? This right here, real almond flour. One cup of almond flour. Let me shave some of that off. So we got the almond flour right here. We're gonna pour it into our cup. Bam, woo! That almond flour looking official. Then so we got the almond flour. We're gonna use four eggs. Don't matter what kind of eggs. I like brown eggs, but due to the current situation, I had to get these boys at Kroger, AKA Smiths. But shout outs to Kroger and the Smiths family for being open so I could make this video and get some food. You know what I'm saying? I gotta get back on my keto stuff, man. I've been slacking, but it's okay. We about to get it popping again. So we're gonna put four eggs into our uh, pancake mix. You know what I'm talking about? One, uh. Oh, sh did y'all see that? I dropped the shit. I'm not a cook. I'm not a perfect cook, but this this is my first video like recording and doing it at the same time. So who cares? Shut up, dog. Uh, three. Hope that don't happen again. I need to step my egg cracking up. You feel me? And then four. So four eggs. This is in there. I don't know why that dog barking. Gotta wash my hands. Excuse me. Feel me? So now I'm done with that. Four eggs. Cream cheese. Now this is the secret ingredient right here. This right here is the cream cheese. I prefer Philadelphia cream cheese. I know there's some other brands out there. I try to use a generic brand to make these. It didn't turn out the same. So if you know any cream cheese that's cheaper, but just as good as Philadelphia, let me know so I can save some coins. So this right here, we're using half a stick of cream cheese for these pancakes, bro. We put cream cheese in here. So right now it's gonna look a little bit like this. It's looking weird, right? So, okay, we got our stuff here. Yeah, everything's here. Then this is where the magic comes in. We're going to, I just bought some new uh, sweetener. So this one is from here. I don't even know, what is that? Swervy. Swervy? Swervy. 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 That sounds like some Quavo. Swervy. Swervy, 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 Swervy. swervy. So we use some Swervy. Yeah, let me do that again. Uh, pretty much is a, uh, I don't know. Ain't got no car, it got three grams of car per service, so we're gonna put a little in there. Swervy! Swervy! So we're gonna put a, mm, I ain't about this measuring life, I'm not a good measurer, so. We're going to put one and a half cup of Swervy in there. These are pretty expensive. Actually, I'm not filling this cup up, that's, that's too much. I didn't even fill this up. I didn't even use the one and a half cup. I just used a little bit, you know what I'm talking about? Jump that in there. Now, this is an optional, but this one right here helps the pancake form a little bit better. Hmm, <laughs> PB fit. Yes, PB fit is going in here. And this gives it more flavor and it gives it a pancake texture and less eggy, you know what I'm talking about? So I type, I typically feel this thing like one and a half cup. I'm gonna put one and a half cup of PB fit in here, you know what I'm saying? But I like it right there, look, ooh, there we go. I like it like that. So bam, now. So this is what our pancake mix is going to look like. Mm-hmm. We got 
PB fit, cream cheese, eggs, almond flour, and our sweetener all up in here. This thing's very filling. I only eat like, I eat this and I don't need no more food for the whole day. So um, this requires a really good blender. So if you ain't got a real good blender, I'm sorry. Can't help you out, bro. But I got the Neutral Bullet RX. This thing right here cuts stuff up. I want the Ninja, but this does amazing work. I love this thing. You gotta make sure this right here is gonna blend because it's gonna, it's gonna be loud. Snap, crackle, pop. Do the rice crispy. So we officially blended everything. Now we have our batter. And let me tell you, this batter is thick. So when you got it done, you might want to let that sit down so things can sit down. So yeah, man, I'm starting my journey in keto. You know what I'm talking about? Again, I be on and off, man, but for profession, I'm an IT guy. Unhealthy job, you sit a lot. Don't get stuff done. Well, you get a lot of done, just don't move a lot. Let me start that over. Well, anyway, y'all catch the point. We're gonna have a nice little conversation. What y'all like to cook? How you lose weight? What kind of workouts you recommend? You know, figure it is what it is. Got nothing but time right now, so I might as well use everything I work for. Anyway, that should be enough of that. But I wish, oh, I can't see the angle, but y'all know, I catch my drift. Ooh, look at that, McGriddle. This is the McGriddle, man, look at that. Bam, perfect pour. Let's see how this one gonna turn out. I put the little flap on so it don't over drip, even though it still dripped a little bit, but it's cool. This is that, uh, the lost episodes right here. This time I'm gonna try to put the keto things inside of it. Let's see how this works. Bam, chocolate chips inside of it. And then we gonna hit it with the drip drip. This is the McGriddle edition. You see that letter M? That stands for McPurk. Ugh. I don't know nothing like that. Mmm. See if I got that flip. Ah. Is it gonna be wet? Oh, perfect though. That one's still wet. But check that one out. This one looks beautiful. You see the golden brown texture? Ooh. They don't know about that. You see this? 100% me. And then I'm gonna hit it with Again, the McGriddle sauce. Hmm. So these are the protein pancakes. Pretty interesting, right? Like, subscribe, tell me what you think. Tell me if you think, I don't, hey, don't ask me how many carbs these got. I don't know. I would say they're less than 20 though. But thank you all for watching. Mm-hmm. That's how those YouTube things be.